I'll start at the point where it all went wrong for Kelly. I was living by my golden rule, always over by fresh cookies. You never know when you're absolutely gonna need another one. I was sitting there in the university common room and in walks this woman, long, dark curled hair. Without a moment's hesitation, I offered the tastiest treat she was ever likely to have. One of my strategic cookies ready to deploy. It was clear. It was love at first bite. Hey, nice. <laughs> Eventually we were faced with a challenge. We were graduating. I was going to have to move back to Essex. How would we make this work? And spoilers, turns out incredible. <laughs> Kelly, I promise to laugh with you and cry with you. I promise to love you in good times and bad, when life seems easy, and when it seems hard. When our love is simple, or when it needs a little bit of effort, <laughs> this is my promise to you today and the rest of my life. Well, Martin, despite not sharing the same blood, our bond is that of true brothers. In every sense and purpose, we've had our fair share of arguments, just like brothers do. But what matters most is how we've always protected and supported each other. We pushed each other to new heights, faced life's challenges side by side. Without our shared experiences, I don't think either of us would be where we are in life. We've never been the kind to exchange heartfelt messages. Instead, it's always been humour, light teasing, to let each other know that we've got each other's backs, and that's just the way our relationship is. Our bond is unbreakable, we are family, and despite the absence of sentimental messages and your god-awful jokes that no one ever understands. <laughs> it's a bond that will endure a lifetime. So Martin, my old friend, I'm honoured to stand here today as your best man. You've always been like a brother to me. I couldn't be happier for you and Kelly. I know you two will have a lifetime of love, laughter, adventure ahead of you. So let's please stand and raise a glass to the happy couple to Martin and Kelly and to a life of happiness together. As I said, 15 years is a very long time. But these few snapshots tell you what you need to know about Kelly. And here's just a few things I know and I have learned about you so far. One. You are beautiful, and you really know how to pick and wear a dress. I mean, I don't know the words, I didn't earlier, and in typical me style, I'm gonna to have to do some serious overthinking before I can even do you justice. Two, just like our proposal to me, in that beautiful forest retreat by the river around Loch Lomond, your planning, your organisation, impeccable ability to take things into your own hands is unparalleled and you make me better for it. You are always eager to get started, make the most of everything, you're intelligent and ferocious and you know what you want. And no, I'm not saying 15 years was too quick a proposal. <laughs> you are fearless and take on new challenges. Somehow you cope with me driving you up the walls, figuratively and even whilst climbing. And five, importantly, you are funny and enjoy a joke or a scare and an adventure is always better with you. It is for this reason you have made every day. <laughs> you have made every day of the last 15 years worth every mile and every minute. And I'm excited for many more years and many more miles <laughs> with you as my wife.